Good afternoon folks and welcome to John's Block. This week we are doing our quote of the month and I've chosen what I believe or who I believe is one of the finest actors that uh, the UK has ever produced. He has done so much. I remember watching him in a really dramatic film about farming um, years and years and years ago. I couldn't tell you whether it was the 70s or the early 80s. I'm going to guess the 70s. Um, he's a Welshman and he has gone on to do Silence of the Lambs, uh, Meet Joe Black and other such films. I am of course talking about Anthony Hopkins, or Sir Anthony Hopkins as he now is. He said something, um, I, I saw it on telly, I actually heard him say this, so I can actually say it came from his mouth, whether he's the originator, originator of it, I don't know. But I'm going to read this to you. None of us are getting out of here alive, so please stop treating yourself as an afterthought. Eat the delicious food, walk in the sunshine, jump in the ocean, say the truth that you're carrying in your heart like a hidden treasure. Be silly, be kind, be weird. There's no time for anything else. So I'll read that again. None of us are getting out of here alive, so please stop treating yourself like an afterthought. Eat the delicious food, walk in the sunshine, jump in the ocean. Say the truth that you're carrying in your heart like a hidden treasure. Be silly, be kind, be weird. There's no time for anything else. Anthony Hopkins. So, that hits a chord with me. Be silly. I've been silly for as long as I can remember. My wife will back that up. Be kind is something that I've learnt. I think it's always been inside me, but I've learnt more recently that it's important to treat people with respect and kindness. And be weird. I don't mean go out and do strange things. Being weird is just be yourself. If somebody thinks it's weird, which they will, then just carry on. As long as you're being kind, and you're not hurting anybody else. What you do should not matter to anybody else. And we live in a world at the moment where everybody's got an opinion on everybody and everything. Um, the thing with opinions, they are the cheapest commodity on the planet because everybody has one. Um, the hard part is letting people have their own opinions, especially if it, if it differs, to your, differs to you. And it doesn't matter whether you're talking about gay marriage, it doesn't matter whether you're talking about politics, religion, um, we all have slightly different views. So it's a matter of just being yourself, and that, that's really what this guy is saying, and live it, live to the life. Don't keep, if you've got a special bottle of perfume for special occasions, use it every day. Use it, because you might not wake up tomorrow morning. That's basically what this is all about. You don't know when your time is up. You could get knocked over by a bus, is the old adage. Um, if you haven't worn those special pair of shoes, or if you haven't worn that special watch, because uh, you, you know, all the jewellery that your grandmother left you, that you only would bring out on family occasions, get out there and wear it. Doesn't matter. You could be gone tomorrow. So that's this week's um, quote. None of us are getting out of here alive, so stop treating yourself like an afterthought. Eat delicious food, walk in the sunshine, jump in the ocean, say the truth that you're carrying in your heart like a hidden treasure. Be silly, be kind, be weird. There's no time for anything else. Sir Anthony Hopkins. So, uh, that's my quote for the month. Um, I've put down the bottom a um, name for the keto group that we've currently got running. Uh, there's a quote in there pretty much every day. Some of them are from famous people, a lot of them are just random stuff that I find online which I love. Uh, there's also a recipe as such. I tell you what I've what I cooked the day before the following morning. I normally wake up between five and six and I'll just stick a post out saying what I had the, the day before. Um, it's keto, so no pasta, no rice, no uh, potatoes, uh, no legumes, beans. Uh, so it is a keto diet which is helping me. Um, for those of you that follow me, you'll know I've reset my, uh, my weight loss goal. Um, I was due to get down to 11 stone 10 by the end of June. Failed on that because we had a, a lovely week's holiday in Scotland, but ate too much and drunk too much, which is definitely not keto. So, but holidays are holidays, you have to take a break occasionally. Uh, so there'll be another recipe coming out uh, next week uh, after this. 
um, which I haven't yet filmed, so I don't know what I'm doing, um, but it will be there on time, 6.15 a week on Wednesday. So take care, we, uh, we look forward to uh, you joining our keto group. The website's in, in construction at the moment with loads of new features getting added. Uh, there'll be some recommended resources, so if anybody wants to sort of take the keto journey further and start buying some resources, not from me, but from third parties, the ones that I would have tried. Uh, Nutraseed is one of them, the juice company that I use. Uh, another one coming on board um, in the not too distant future as well. So they'll all be there for you to just click on, go through, you get a discount for using it through, uh, through our group. So take care of yourselves and we will see you soon. Bye for now.